Metro Technology Centers, preparing for life. Dexterity, concentration, and teamwork. Three main ingredients a student needs for the Metro Technology Center's Surgical Technologist Career Major. Students in the Surge Tech program use the latest technology to learn proper techniques and equipment in the surgical setting. We're using um, laparoscopic instruments and we're doing a simulation of a laparoscopic cholecystectomy, which is the removal of a gallbladder. We have a laparoscopic trainer helping to provide the, uh, the simulation for laparoscopic surgical procedures. It helps to reinforce the concept of teamwork. It also helps to provide opportunities for the students to get to actually use the instruments that they're learning how to pass and hand to the surgeons. In movies and dramatic television shows, the passing of the scalpel is seamless. In the real world, handing off instruments takes skill and a lot of practice. That exchange from one person to the next can sometimes be very awkward. So if the students can get used to doing those things here at the school, then when they're actually in the surgical procedure with the surgeon, it makes it more comfortable for the surgical technologist and it makes it easier for the surgeon. It's really important to make sure that you're working as, as a member of the team, that transition of passing instruments or handing instruments safely to the surgeon and being able to retrieve them uh, and maintain an organized sterile field is very important. Students from many backgrounds are working toward their certification, a certification that at one time was not required. Um, when I did it, it didn't require certification where it does now. Um, back then I worked um, cardiovascular surgery, surgery mainly, that's what I want to go back to, but also would like to work with uh, some of the missions and and go to hopefully third world countries and, and be able to work over there. Robert's past experience has painted a picture of what it's like in the field for Karen Renshaw. He's told us a lot of real life experiences that he has had. And then the other classmates have come from different experiences. And then Ms. Bushy has done it for years so she can give us about every scenario that comes up. Karen changed career paths dramatically and gave up part of her first passion to pursue another. I rodeoed professionally for 13 years. I still have a horse. I sold my good horse last September and used that money, part of that money, to go here and just pay my living expenses while I'm at school. Well, I wanted to get into the healthcare field for years. I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do. Surgical tech came up and I read the description and just something, bells went off, I guess you could say, and I thought, that's what I want to do. Since coming to Metro Tech, Karen has seen firsthand her future profession. What? Probably the most enjoyable day was when Miss Bushy made it possible for us to go to Baptist. And I watched three surgical techs set up the sterile field. And I just thought that right there, this, I picked the right thing. The Surge Tech program was one of many health career programs that participated in a mock hospital experience, the Metro Care Center. They had an LPN down here that was um, asking the patient questions, confirming their information. So we kind of got to see, you know, what happened on that end. And then after that was finished, we completed, we, uh, excuse me, we transferred the patient uh, down to our holding area um, before we took them back into the, to the OR, our mock OR. Every aspect of a hospital, including caring for inmates, was represented and acted out during the day's events. The whole exercise was really beneficial because we got to see it from start to finish. You know, the whole process, everyone's role uh, from getting the patient, you know, in the front door to, to discharge, so it's pretty neat. Health career students experienced plausible real-life situations. We are training surgical technologists to provide safe patient care for the public. Our profession is one that is kind of unique. Not that many people understand or know about the role or the job of a surgical technologist. So it is very important that the surgical technologist uh, students learn that they're providing 
a service and a benefit to the patient. Our customers are employers at the hospital, so we're excited that they feel like the graduates of our program meet the standards that they have at their hospital. Those interested in becoming a surgical technologist have many options to receive college credit with Oklahoma City Community College. The only prerequisites are a high school diploma or GED uh, and being able to have current CPR certification, American Heart Basic Life Support. We offer a number of different options for taking the CPR um, depending upon what meets the schedule. There's afternoons, there's evenings, there's Saturdays. There's a lot of different opportunities. The surgical technology program uh, also coordinates or articulates with Oklahoma City Community College. So there is actually a two-year degree that students can earn an applied science and surgical technology. Students who have had a number of college credit hours may come to us and they, have, they may have already finished enough of their general education courses that by the time they finish our course here at Metro Tech, they complete here as well as graduate with their associate's degree at Oklahoma City Community College. Students are encouraged to have completed medical terminology and anatomy and physiology prior to beginning the Surge Tech program. By doing so, it lightens their academic load and it makes it a more manageable um, time for them to be uh, here at our school. But we, we offer those, those courses during our program, but it makes it a little bit easier for the students if they have already completed those before they come to us. These students have been practicing uh, and learning pharmacology, so what we have here is just a small sampling of some different types of syringes. Uh, being able to differentiate between what type of syringe is used for what, making sure that they can uh, understand about labeling medications, the importance and significance of that for safety on the sterile field as well as for patient safety, um, different types of irrigating solutions and equipment used for those things, how to withdraw medication from vials and ampules, uh, knowing the difference and the, the appropriate technique to use so that Everything remains sterile so that there's no contamination, providing the patient with the best possible, hopefully, outcome that they can have. The Surge Tech program prepares students for success in the field of surgical technology. This is a very academically rigorous program. It is very challenging. However, it's also very rewarding. Um, students that come here work extremely hard. They, um, they, they have a lot of demand placed on them as far as the academics that we have here, the th courses that they have to take and the minimum grade that they have to make in order to pass. But when they get to the surgical, um, get to the hospitals and they can actually practice some of those skills, I think it, it comes into play. Our program is recognized by hospitals throughout our city as being a, an excellent program. So I would encourage anyone that's interested to check into being a surgical technologist if, if this is the field that's right fitting for you. For students like Robert and Karen, MetroTech is helping them move one step closer in becoming the surgical technologist they want to be. You know, honestly, I've looked at other programs and um, the, the money side of it is, I mean, it, it's big for everybody. It's something you got to consider. That's probably the thing that sent me over here. But the thing that really landed me was everyone's attitude here. I mean, I, I asked them the first day if there was something in the water uh, because everybody's so nice, they smile. Um, but, but now that I'm in here, I can honestly say it's because they really take the time to teach you. Um, they don't have their hand on the door. When you have a question, they take the time to answer it. So you really feel like you're getting what you pay for here.